it's really good to work on a project that has results in the short term rather than looking at a 10, 20, 30 year programme. I'm Graham Dunbar, I'm ST42 Project Manager. On a day-to-day -day basis, I talk to most people in the company. I look after the drawing office, I manage the drawing office facility, who are a very competent group of people and we're very lucky to have them. We then have the personnel involved in actually the building of the Tokamak. And then we have the designers, so we have what you might describe as mechanical designers and electrical designers. But behind them are the physicists who actually say what they'd, they'd like. The design has to follow the, the physics. I also talk to a lot of to the uh, suppliers. Our supplier base is really key to us keeping on target in terms of programme. So the development of the supplier base is a big part of, of what I do. Vessel is probably the most difficult to control because it consists of thousands of parts and everyone is bespoke and there's a lot of exotic materials in there. The way we've concentrated is designing from the inside out. So we've, we've moved from the inside the vessel right way through to the external part. Most of this is stainless steel or has to be non-magnetic. The challenges have mainly been finding suppliers and the correct materials. It is a complex project. It's slightly unusual. Uh, the projects I'm used to working with have been done before. Nuclear fusion, ST40, is extremely complex. We're pushing materials to extremes of durability. I've got a few years to go before I retire. And I'd like to be sat at home and actually using power from one of these devices. That's the goal, is that I see, uh, see this grid connected and I'm in part of the group that do that.